Yeah, I don't know. All right, guys, we're looking to do no prep racing this weekend with the Freedom Civic, but we want to get a, a handle on the traction. So we're going to go ahead and start getting the wheel speed stuff all done. You saw as we got the kit from DP Race Parts, uh, they hooked us up with that. And in the front, we're just going to throw a little hall sensor um, on the ABS ring. Also got the bank shift billy. I need to wire up and set up and uh, get a handle on that as well. So that'll be our slipper valve for the clutch. And then we'll get these speed sensors done. This baby ready to no prep race this weekend. We want to use all of our electricity. And then uh, we can just pop that axle out a little bit enough to get the, the speed ring on. And then we'll fasten that down to that. And uh, now we just got to wire that up. In the front here, we need to drill and tap here, and then we can just put a sensor down. I took, this is the De La Cruz, which we're a dealer for, by the way. Front speed sensor, front ABS one. Now we're in. All right, get that De La Cruz bracket on there. All right, all right. Brackets on. Those little sensors he makes are pretty sweet too. Oh yeah, they're great. He's got his emblem on it and his part number. I don't know if you can see that on camera. All right, that's looking pretty dang good. Jet. Set to jet. All right, so that's all tied up now. Got the wire all zip tied. We're running up into the car. I'm gonna throw the brakes back on. And the uh, front's pretty much done. We will need a mallet for sure. We just want it warm enough, long enough to where we can yeah. move it around. Steven, get ready to pull back like crazy up. Okay. Steve up. Okay. Now you need to lift up. Don't put it too hard. Yep, it's in. It's in. That one's ready to set depth. Okay. All right, guys, I'm getting my bank shift billy all mounted in here. Uh, I've got my lines on now coming in and uh, coming through here. So let's just try this slipper valve. We did a little video on it before. I just got to wire things up, get the controller in, and we'll be ready to go to Steel City Shootout tomorrow and uh, do some no prep racing and see how we line up. Sounds like they're going to put us in the big tire class, so we're against the, some monsters of cars. Uh, we'll see how we stack up, line up and uh, start dialing this baby in and, you know, just give it our best. He's testing the speed sensors. Our Colorado weather has been weird. comes up I think I might have the slip a little long but that's what we got to play with I think yeah I've got the dead zone real good okay let me ever unplug that damn thing real quick which thing the slipper so I can move it. is it hard to move with it because the pedal comes up and stops right where you're trying to release it uh, we are out here today at the Steel City shootout out here in Pueblo Motorsports Park uh, we've got the Freedom Civic we ended up in big tire class so I'm Super anxious to see how it'll do today. We're gonna try to see where we stand. This will give us some data, some knowledge. I'm anxious to get out there and uh, do some ripping. See how this thing will perform. Start getting the data and start learning how to do some of this no prep. One of these little all-wheel drive hot rods. So, and it looks like we're gonna actually be drag racing backwards on the track. So that's pretty crazy, but it should be a lot of fun. So we're gonna get this thing set up and uh, get out there and do some ripping. <laughs> Yeah. So with the rules, you can run one set of slicks and one set of um, street tires. They can't even be like radial. They have to be like 200 tread, rare, tread wear or whatever. And we're so, running all four, slicks. all four slicks. So that puts us in the big tire. And they, Win or lose, like we'll just, at least we'll have knowledge. So that's where I'm at. But that thing is so sick. Oh, yeah. We were just talking, I don't know if he drives around on one engine. Yeah. He driving around when he started it, a second ago, it sounded like one engine. Yeah. So. 
That's got an engine in the front and the back. Yeah, so those are both exhaust. That's featured on 1320. Yeah. Sick. Yeah. All right, guys. So you can see the scoreboards right there and there. And uh, this is actually where we'll be coming through. We actually race from this line that way. So the entire shutdown is the race, which is, this is crazy. This is cool. But uh, it's long enough, I guess, to get her shut down. Where those cones are way down there. Got, okay, there they are. Okay, those are the eighth mile. So I believe we race to there or somewhere in this area. I'm learning, but this is crazy. This is cool. It's crazy to see the back of the boards and uh, all these people out here. We're gonna have a driver's meeting in just a minute here and uh, start figuring this out. <laughs> Gavin's going to be managing big tire chip draws and stuff right there. But I need to make sure that who we got, how many, so his chip counts right. So, Justin Willis, Jordan, Royce, He's here. Brent, yep. Trent Diaz, oh lord, Hayden, yeah. Joey, yeah, he's back Lawrence here. Cena, I need for you to keep on coming. I get cars two feet past starting line. So if you're going to bump, go to the first line. If you're not going to bump, go right to the starting line. But when I'm waving, that doesn't mean I'm not staging you guys. That's not what I'm doing. So your crew is supposed to be staging all. So if you keep coming you forward, on the thing. I mean, I'm not I've, watching him. I'm watching you. Go, I'll put but you on the thing. Yeah. Well, he's doing that. That's you getting on the two stage. This is my first time here. So, so if you need to put on the two step, if you need to take a drink of your coffee, I get it's just so you're ready. You do like five waves? Five waves. Five waves, okay. And if right, all of our big tire cars here. You guys all here? I'm sure one more time. And you didn't come. You held it a little high for Matt there. <laughs> <laughs> um, so she's, you're gonna go over and see her on ones. Fives. This is gonna be five first round. Oh. Ooh. I'm definitely okay with that. Brent? Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> Get some data. Sweet. Figure out how this works. Hey, I did. Right, like it all. All right, so he's got a Fairmont. We're gonna run, but uh, we both got green, so we're gonna flip. Right here. Got it. Thank you. You want to call it? Right. Hey, so if you go out and your grudge race, yeah, heads. Keep a it is a trip. Like, heads. Barrier. Right. Right. Right lane. Okay. Fifth pair. Fifth pair. Good right luck, on. Man. Good luck. Right on. They're on. Yep. They're running these two on their call out just to kick it off. Yep. Um, I probably want to stay down here and watch that real quick. Yeah, IDT. And then they're gonna do the. Um, I took a picture of the run order, so it's small dollar, and then us. Okay. And, and then we're the fifth pair, so. If we go out, no big deal, we can run the grudge. So I was kind of excited to have the buy to like small get the data, because I think we could learn a lot time, quick, grudge, but uh, they just had just done the chips, time. so. We are shooting the so dice. Small dollar. Yeah. We've never big done time, a no grab like this with this car. No idea. We just oh. changed a lot. That we have yeah. no info on. So <laughs> bear with By us. The way, we bear with us. This is going to be fun. Holy cow over here and wheels on wheels for your food today. It's going to be great. I love this. Yeah. We're here to but we're going to catch Hayden making a rip real quick. They're going to catch Joey. This has been like a big time call out. Yeah. And they're going to kick this so, over. Eventually, we're going to have to go to the next one. Yeah. Yeah. This is going to be a big call out. Yeah. And they're going to kick this whole event off. So this is this all comes back to the the Colorado big tire argument. So Joey's very stern on the 28 as a small tire. And Hayden races all over the country, which normally it's 29, 29 and a half, is small tire. So here we are. So there's that argument that they always race off and try and figure it out. <laughs> and Hayden's on Why are you so stoked? I've never done this before. I see either. We're I'm excited. Back, I'm so excited. They're still going to race each other anyway. Expect, so uh, um, um, right after. I just didn't know what to expect at all. So I was just thinking, like, kind of regular, whatever, a little flashlight. And, but I have no idea. Yeah, you're me neither. On, you're and on the street outlaws right now. Like, oh, yeah. It's cool. Like, the amount of people that have come out already is yeah. super fun. And the merch is cool. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. I don't think I've got to well, see We've been for him against him. Yeah. Well, I got a bet for him. He's All my right. boy, so. I have something to say. Yeah. With me. 
at all times. <laughs> Just FYI. Why? Eric mailed me the spare. <laughs> at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave for the land of the free and the home of the brave. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fantastic. That's like, that's like, that's like, what about the other lane? A little cooter out there. It'll this is going to be a little hours. exhibition sure. pass right now, right here. Move it. Try something new and yeah. we've never no. done it before. You gotta Just guess at numbers. We guess. Is it fun? Oh, it's always fun. I felt like I was on his light really good. I thought you had a bi Oh, well, they screwed that up. They screwed that up. It would have been nice if we had a bi So you didn't have bi No. <laughs> no, we lost the bi but, trying... but we're trying things to be more consistent, faster out the hole, and, uh, you know bit us but there's some grudge runs and uh, we'll have to call some people out see how we stack up with some fast stuff trying to get to the low spot here 997 almost a thousand rpm no under 997 how did it not die i don't know geez that was rough yeah. from like 8,000 to 900 
Run an 8,000 to 900. Agent's pissed at me for that. There's like 25 pounds out there and it's heavy. Like I can, this was the tune that we were kind of heavy on the fuel on our target. So, I mean, I can clean that up. I want to just unplug the slipper, go back to you preloading it. And just and our normal routine. Making it move, yeah. Um, that one EGT Looks matches like up now. Yeah. Oil pressure. Get down there. So, our EGTs do match up. Like, I mean, right here, it dumped a four. It, yeah. Because it tried shutting off. Yeah, it it was, you know, when the motor's at 900, it stopped. Like, the motor basically stopped there. Yep. I'm trying to remember what it... I'm going to open an old log, see what it makes preloading. It made the same. Your 9.0, it was making 8.9. Mm. So, so weird. You made the same boost, unloaded as loaded. Okay. Well, that was also a... Yeah, that 9.0, because remember it was like trying to get up, trying to get up, and then it gets up finally. So that was 8.9 pounds. This was your 9.0. And then this one, see, 9.7. But we are a little lower DA down here. Oh, it's horrible. <laughs> Frost was like, Jamie, what the hell? I'm like, dude, we just put a slipper in it. Like, yeah. We never use it. We're learning. That was the first hit on it, so. There it is. Look at that. broken axle. We'll Looks like we caught ourselves a race. So we're gonna head up there right now and run a grudge run. And uh, see if we can't make this thing move this time. Uh, I got my foot back into it and I undid the slipper for now. And I'll come back to that later. I'm trying to learn a little bit. Hopefully I can make it not bog this time. All right guys, we're up. Let's get another go at this uh, no prep stuff. See what it's all about. We get to 8,000 right there. See the timings, pull and given, pull and given, one to three degrees. And then all of a sudden the RPM starts coming down. Timing comes down. As the RPM comes down, as the RPM comes down, it starts to lean out. 
and then the RPM's down, it's leaned out, timing's all back in it, because it's below the threshold. So, so you said I let it come all the way down, and it's like, ugh. I know, that's so why I was like, just let it idle, and then try and just stab it. I, I don't know if it's the dun 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 dun, but like it was fine on the last one. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it goes from fine to not fine. So they all look the same, just like that, huh? Yep. Yeah, we went and bought brand new coils. Yeah, this is. Thought we had it figured out. Thought maybe that would do it. Turn the it dwell way down, pass. huh? So it did for one pass. Well, it seemed to do it when it's cold. Cool, it'll two step no problem, but when it's warm, it has this, it does this. And it does seem to be a temp based deal on. Timing. It's like right there is negative five. It's at its RPM. Or almost. It's not even to its RPM yet. Like right there, it made it to 7,100. And it stayed at negative five degrees. And then it comes, it gets down to 69. Comes back up to 22. Back down to negative four. And then the RPM comes back down to 69. The timing comes back in like 25 degrees but it says it's on two steps so it just comes out of my parameters So we have a, we have a bug, we have a bug. So we're gonna have to dive in and uh, chase this out of it, honestly. It's like seeing this first one, the one that it just actually did it, see the timing's pulled at that like 7200, 7100, 7200. And then it stands up to the next step and goes up to where it belongs. You know, see the fuel's fine. We're like 11.8, goes up 11.7. Then this one, see, it gets a little richer there. And then it just pulls the timing out and the fuel's fine. Like it gives the timing back. Yeah. Why? 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 Nice job, Dad. I don't think you guys know what's going on. We don't know what's going on. That is accurate. Well, we know that something's going on. Well, but you don't know the reasoning. Yeah. yeah. Grr. A two step once, fine. Here. Shut it off, tried it again, and it didn't. So, if you go ahead and fix that for us? Yeah. Um, what you're going to want to do is. something with the two step so the one thing that's bothering me so the one thing that's different with this than everything is the two step button or the clutch from everything else try to take it off i did i tried putting it by speed watch this oh yeah 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 you did that's how you were just doing it. no no i've had to push the clutch because watch look come sit up here and look Okay, so I put it to front rear wheels or rear wheels. So it's not off the clutch button, not off any of that. It's not off anything. Loads. It doesn't come across and say two step. And I come up to diagnostics panel and it says off. Well, that is weird. Yeah. But with no two-step, it revs up freely. Yep. 
So look here, made it to the 8,000. Everything's fine. Timing's pulled. It's actually banging. There. Yeah, if it sat like overnight, it would just work in the morning. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, what's that? But the fact that we can't switch it to speed is a bug. Yeah. Got big tire final here. Scuba Steve and his GTR. My client's GTR. I think he's his isn't running at the moment, but this is one he built. It is beautiful. Against this bad old Firebird. That thing is so weak. Like it might have. All right, semifinals. Hayden is in the semifinals. Small tire. Hayden's been running small tire and big tire. I think Hayden got it. I don't know. I'm waiting to hear. Yeah. Check the replay. That was close. That was tough. Who won? That last round went down a little number 307. Mustang winner, left lane. Oh, the Mustang won. Good left job, Hayden. Let me repeat that. Another one. All right, guys, we're all loaded back up, but we're going to call it there. I might try the ECU out of Skiddy and uh, see if the two-step problem gets solved from that because it's there's some super strange stuff going on. Um, it works while it's cold, warms up, the two-step kind of fades away. We thought coils, so we checked that. We thought maybe the ground of the coils, so I added a ground of the coils. It Nothing solved it. As long as it was warm, it was not going to two-step. Um, so that's a, that's a kind of a gremlin in our lives right now and you know we'll solve it we're just gonna have to we're just gonna have to comb some things and uh, get back into it but this event here was awesome to see James from Bill Toon Race and a lot of other friends here out here today and it was just badass coming out supporting making some laps I'd like to done better but you don't always win them we had a great time and I can't wait to do it again so Sounds like they're gonna do something in July. I'm gonna make sure I'm out here ripping with all these guys again. And uh, you know, we'll see if we can't put on a better show. That's for sure. But that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. We appreciate you guys hanging out and being part of the channel. Give us a like, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. And we'll tackle this problem. <laughs>